Okay, let's see. I hope this thing isn't fuzzy. Okay, let's see here. I am trying to get rid of a lot of products. So, I have like, not half empty, but maybe, I don't know, just like a little bit left out of about four containers. So, I used an old organic raw coconut butter container. I said coconut butter. What's wrong with me? I used an old organic raw cocoa butter container. And here's what I did. Because I'm trying to downsize. All, all these conditioners is, is too much. It's unnecessary. So, I put in this container, I have no idea, maybe a fourth a cup of aloe vera gel. Then I had a fourth, about a fourth of cup of quenched curls left, so I dumped some of that in there. Then I did a big old squirt of Garnier Fruit Teas Sleek and Shine. Put a big old squirt of that in. Then I put a couple of dollops of jojoba oil in there, along with some melted cocoa, no, along with some melted shea butter. And then I put in like a dash of coconut oil for shine. So then I mixed it all up and then I let it kind of solidify. So it's a little bit creamy. I won't, I was hoping that the, the Garnier Fructis, the Sleek and Shine would give it like a creamy top of a base and it did. And then I wanted the shea butter, you know, to hold it all together, which it did. So I co-washed co my hair last night with some Sonoma conditioner. And I don't know why it's Sonoma, something I got at TJ Maxx, you know, I gotta stay out of there. And so I washed it and I put a braid here and one here. Here, 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 and here. And I put it in there, I co-washed it, and then I let it air dry where it was almost dry, probably like 99% dry. Then I put just my new concoction on there, braided it up, and went to bed. Woke up and it was really defined, which scared me. I was like, oh crap, I don't know what I'm gonna do because I wanted it like this. So I took the braids down and then I, I was ironing some clothes and getting ready for work and then it ended up like this. So here's the front, here's the side view, back view, don't know if I'm in the video, another side, okay. And I am quite pleased and when I was making this concoction it was like I'm either going to love it or I'm going to hate it and I kind of hope I hate it so that you know no harm no foul but I really like it and the thing that sucks is is that I didn't write down any recipe, but that's all right, because I'm not trying to buy any more quench curls. You know, I, I wasn't happy with it alone, but this right here, my hair is shiny, and it's bouncy, and it's full. I like it because it's full, and it's not flat, and I have a headband in here. I don't know if you can see that, but I am so excited. So that's my new concoction. So you never know what you're going to find in your cabinet when you start dumping stuff together. So my husband have already said, again, your hair is going to fall out. You keep mixing stuff up. But I just thought I would share what my results was today. I am so happy with this. My hair has never been this defined on a first day braid out. So yeah, so that's what it is. So I'm so excited. Just thought I'd share.